ladies and gentlemen, I stumbled upon a uh, solution to a very annoying problem that I've been having for about a probably a year. Well, for my work, I stay at hotels all the time. And about a year or so ago, I starting with some hotels, I couldn't log into their Wi-Fi from my uh, MacBook. The login page would not come up. The Wi-Fi icon would say I'm connected, but then I would open up uh, my browser and try to go to a web page that said not connected to the internet. And uh, basically it was because the login page would not pop up. After struggling with, uh, I think, one hotel, I spent a couple hours uh, or longer on the phone with their, their tech guy. Uh, the end solution for him at, the, at that point was to actually manually put in my IP address or something to get approve it, get it connect to the uh, internet. And yeah, that was fine for that one time, but I'm not going to do it every time. I, go, I went back to that hotel, same problem. I would have had to call up. I'm sure I would have had to spend another couple hours on the phone while they tried to figure out, try every other method before they go to the automatically putting my IP address in there. I checked the internet, uh, discussion boards, and there was uh, several proposed uh, solutions, none of which worked for me. And this one works every time. It's still kind of a little bit of a pain in the butt, and I wish Apple would fix it for one, once and for all. But this is what I did. Uh, for those of you who have uh, boot camp and a, a side of your uh, computer partition so that you have a Windows operating system on it, I, I did this, and I'll show you. Went into System Preferences. Go to the Startup Disk. And to make changes to this, you have to put in your password. Now this is ungrade, and you say, I want to start the computer up. I'm oh, sorry. Start the computer up in boot camp. Press restart, which I won't do now because it will turn off this, this uh, quick time player that I've got going here recording this. And then I go into my Windows side, pull up my browser software, log into the uh, hotel Wi-Fi, and no problem. Do not like operating on that side of a computer. So then I, I switched back to the Mac side, and today when I did, did this, I did that not have to log into the hotel um, Wi-Fi again. I think in some other cases, I, uh, the login page actually did pop up, if I remember correctly. But anyways, so without a problem, every time now, I've tried this several uh, different hotels. It's working like a charm. It is a little bit of pain in the butt, and I wish I didn't have to do it, but uh, if you've spent, like me, hours and hours scouring the Internet trying to find a solution to it, this is one that worked for me. So uh, I hope you like it. If you do, please give me the thumbs up. And uh, also, if you wouldn't mind uh, subscribing to my channel. I don't have a lot of computer-related stuff, but I've got a wide variety of videos that I think uh, you will find something interesting there for you. And uh, also, uh, as always, please comment, particularly if you find success with this, or if, even if you don't find success with it, uh, give me a little comment as to what your experience was with this solution. Hope this, you find this helpful. I'm just thrilled that I uh, found this solution, kind of stumbled on it, and I felt compelled to share it with everyone. Thank you.